Hey, what's up guys? I want to make a video today sharing with you a niche that I found that is starting to trend. But before I get into the niche, I just want to share with you my two courses that I have on Gumroad. The first one is a Merch by Amazon Masterclass, a step-by-step -step beginner's guide for mastering Merch by Amazon. It's only $19.99. It comes with 16 lessons and you get over an hour of content. This course is good for people that are beginners on Merch or people that are struggling to get sales. Then I also have one on Redbubble. It's also a master class step-by-step guide for mastering Redbubble, only $19.99. This one comes with 20 lessons and you also get over an hour of content. Also good for beginners or for people that are struggling to get sales on Redbubble. Here are my credentials on Merch. I have over 10,000 sales and I've done over 35,000 in royalties. I'm a tier eight seller. And when we go to Redbubble, you're gonna see the past few months, I did $266, $317, and then $248. So if you're interested in one of those courses, the links will be in the description, and I'll also have them as a pinned comment. Okay, now let's get into the content in the video and take a look at the niche. So the niche is I cheer for the punter. Um, if we look at the competition, you're gonna see there's only 621 results. I still don't have the BSRs on Amazon. Um, so what I did is I just went to Merch Informer, and if you look at the BSRs on Merch Informer for this phrase or this niche, you're, oh, I got a sale. You're going to see that um, the BSR is 78,000. This one has a BSR, oh, another one. I got a BSR of 329,000, or no, I don't, but this one has a BSR of 329,000, another one at 300,000. So you can see that this design or this phrase is selling. When we go to um, test to see if this is trademarked, we type in the phrase, we hit enter, and we'll see that nothing pops up. And when we look at the competition at some of the other POD sites like Etsy, I did a poll the other day to see if people were selling on Etsy, and a lot of people said they're not. I would highly recommend selling on Etsy. Um, for me, it's actually my best platform to see if I do better on Etsy than I do on Merch. Um, so you know, if, if you um, you know if you're not selling on Etsy, I definitely recommend it. If we look at the Competition on Redbubble, you see there is going to be a little more competition than Etsy, 295 results. But to be honest, for Redbubble, that's pretty good. Usually, these new niches, they're already like in the thousands or the two thousands. And when we look at TeePublic, we're going to see that there's also some designs up, but still very little competition. Um, so that is going to be the uh, niche for today. I would recommend that you probably, you know, do something a little different than just the text. You know, add in a football, add in a you know silhouette of a punter or something you know just so you can kind of different differentiate yourself um, but that's going to be the niche uh, for today if you're interested in the courses take a look at the links and that's basically it so thanks a lot for watching consider subscribing if you like this kind of content um, uh, subscribe click the bell and i'll catch you on the next one all right thanks so much for watching and hopefully i'll see you tomorrow bye bye